Yo, 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 what's goody good people? I'm back. Hold on. Let me take these off. Let me take these ultras off. Alright, I'm back with another cap cop before I head out. Something light, little four clip for y'all. All stone crowns. Matter of fact, I'm gonna show them to y'all in order. I love stone crowns. I think stone Vegas gold is probably going to become the new off-white chrome for the hat community. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong, but let's dive into these. First, let's start off with this 1935 World Series Detroit Tigers. This hat is fire, fire. Stone crown, black button, black bill, pink UV, 1935 World Series side patch, right? Flat embroidery and puff embroidery. I love that about this side patch. Love when side patches got flat and puff embroidery. Or even puff embroidery alone, like you don't, that's just not a big thing like that. So when I see puff embroidery on a side patch, I get excited. I love the flat logo on the front. Nasty. I got this from Fam Cap. I definitely got this from Fam Cap. Alright. Cooperstown Batterman. It is puff though. Not flat. Still cool with me. Black guts. This hat was made in China. You know it's from overseas. They come with these tags. Alright. So that came from across the water for me. hat was packed. That stone waving cub, or I like to call it the hello cub. The hello cub. Ooh, from hat club. Mm, stone crown, royal bill, classic green UV. Flat batterman, tonal flag, white guts. At 1990 All-Star Game side patch. Now, this side patch has become infamous. It's become infamous. But this hat was 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 a panic. For me, it was a panic. For the community, I think it was a panic too. Yeah. And this hat is made in Bangladesh. Good bang bang. <laughs> Me. It gets even meaner. It gets meaner. The B More Orioles from Leeds. Big Jack spazzed on this. Big Jack spazzed on this, bro. I don't know. It's just a clean, classic looking hat. If it didn't have a hook, this would still be an amazing hat. Stone Crown. Now, I want to call this brick, and it is brick. It just has more red to it. Um, I know on the camera it might look like it have some orange in, an orange tint to it. I don't know. Um, but that brick bill, classic green UV, white guts, flat batty, brick red flag. And that 50th side patch by the order, this is becoming a, um, a go-to now by designers as well. Good, mean, classic hat. <laughs> nah, Big Jack's pass on that hat, I'm sorry. Oh, and last but not least, this is my favorite of the stones that I'm showing y'all today. Um, Can't recall if this one was Panic, though. I know the Cubs was, but the Blue Jays. The Blue Jays. Another one from Hat Club. Let's get into it. Stone Crown. Cardinal Brick Red. Bill. Classic Green UV. Flat Batterman. White Guts. 
that 10th anniversary side patch, even though it's not tall, I don't know, it's something about those Blue Jay side patches that I just love, all right? Love that side patch. The front logo is all flat embroidery. It gives this hat this, that vintage vibe, because you know all the logos used to be flat on the older um, hats from the 90s, late 80s, early 90s. And I don't know what made them go flat on this, but it just, it added to the hat. I'm a fan of puff, but for some reason, flat works on this. It just, it's screaming vintage, so I'm with it. Mm. From Hat Club. Mean. Mean. And that's it. Those are my cap cops. You know what? I don't think I showed y'all the flag on the Detroit Tigers. It does have a black New Era flag. It's not tonal like the other hats. But that's my little four clip. My little four clip cap cop. Alright. Let me know what stone crowns y'all y'all rocking, man. I'm out. Peace.